boys and girls and welcome to a brand new video. Now as you can see here, bonnet of this car is pretty destroyed from all the cats. So this presents an ideal opportunity to try the new Evo car polishing pastes. The first thing that we will do is sand down the bonnet using the circular polisher Mirka de Ross with a 5mm shift. We will use this with coax, we will use this with the coax dry sanding paper granulated at 1500 and 2000. This job is pretty simple and very quick using this machine and these papers. But remember, there is no need to press the machine onto the surface. So after we finished sanding down the hood or bonnet, we'll start with the heavy cut paste from Evocar. It's a water-based paste with a cut value of 10 of 10 and gloss value of 7 of 10. We will put only four drops of this paste on a wool pad placed on a rotary polisher. So now let's see how this paste performs. We will start spreading the paste using 800 RPM on the machine. And as you can see here, the paste evenly spreads very quickly and it's see-through. See this means that during the cutting process, we see what's happening while you're performing the job. This is very important. The paste also does not leave any dust residue. And the rotary machine is still at 800 RPM, which, a with PM, which aids to warming up the paste sufficiently. Now we will change the speed to 1000 RPM and during the entire process we will never go above 1100 rpm when you're doing the cut process it is best to angle the rotary polisher about 30 degrees to the side of which the polisher itself rotates as we finish up with the angular cutting process we will lay down the machine flat and use 1100 rpm speed my first impression of using this paste is a very positive one so now let's use a dry microfiber cloth to remove the residue and see the results but before we see our final result of course we have to degrease the surface my first impressions of this first cut is that the paste did more than an exceptional job If you have any experience in using the rotary polishers, you should see no holograms at all after using this paste. As you can see here, the paste did an excellent job removing all the scratches, not leaving any holograms, nor are there any tracks of the use of wool. The shine after using this hard cut paste is very good. But now we will move on to using the middle cut paste, which is a finishing paste as well. So what we have here is the fine cut finishing compound paste with a cut value of 5 of 10 and a gloss value of 10 of 10. For this purpose, we will use a DA machine rotary polisher using an Evocar pad. As you can see here, this paste is very greasy. It can be spread easily. There is no actual pressure applied to the machine and the machine works at speeds of 4 to 4.5. Machine is Rupert's brand 15, Mark 3.
now let's see the results that we get from using this paste. Of course, the only way to see your true result is after degreasing the surface. So now let's wipe off the paste using a dry microfiber cloth. And as you can see here, the paste is easily removed. Now let's move on to the degreasing part. Do not wipe off immediately, give it and then wipe it off. Now, as far as I can see, the results are stunning. But don't believe me, look at it yourself. We managed to get this type of results in a very short amount of time. I could recommend both of these pastes for one layered polishing, the rough cut as well as the fine cut. As you can see, the paste does not leave any traces behind it, nor does it whiten the paint job itself. So now this is our final result, where there are no traces left behind from the cats, nor do you see any residue from the sanding. I forgot to mention that the bonnet on this car is aluminum. This makes it a little bit more difficult to polish because aluminum itself cools down very quickly. But as seen in this video, you don't have to use high RPM to polish with this machine and thus remove all the scratch marks. So, thank you for watching. Boys and girls, please like, share and subscribe. Hit the notification icon to get all the notifications on our videos. Stay safe, take care of yourselves and until next time, goodbye.